It's Mr. Mixer Garage Band Guru. Wanted to share with you how to make a Garage Band uh, 1.1 piece using the guitar and trying not to use so many tracks. So if you go here to the timeline, you can see there's only one track being used. Go back to guitar. We're going to record a little piece of the G and C chord together using the autoplay one, and then we're going to go over it and merge it uh, with some other piece and still use only one track. It's very helpful. So let's do the C first. So you can see that this turned from red to green, this bar up here. Now, it is uh, set to go for eight bars, but if you go here now and hit Merge Recordings, turn it to On. Now we're going to go to the Autoplay 2 and do the same thing with our C and G chord. See how it changes? That uh, picking now can go in front of the other uh, strumming that was going on before. I made a mistake because I didn't change over to the G, but I did that on purpose because I want to show you that now you can just hit here undo. So it kept your first recording, but that second one where you made a mistake and didn't change over to the G in after the fourth bar, now that part's erased. So we're going to merge again, but we'll make the correct change over to the G chord and then back to C. So now we'll do another recording over the top of this one, put on autoplay 3. Back to the start, we don't have to undo because we like it, so now listen to the difference. And we'll add that to the same track. Again, I made a mistake because my battery is low, so we'll do undo and start again. So that's one way you can combine the same instrument family uh, and using the merge. I believe you can change now to other instruments. Like if you wanted to put a root rock over that, you can do that without a problem. So let's see what this four sounds like. Let's try it. I see what it did. It changed all of our acoustics over to Roots Rock. So uh, you may want to play around with that and if you want um, all sorts of different sounds using the autoplay go for that. And then you can also remember use uh, two finger combinations and three finger combinations on all of that. So mess around with that using the merge recordings feature. Take care.